Titans. And Gets my and my wins. theory is that Dark Rain Falcon punched <laughs> the gas machines and it exploded. Okay? What? <laughs> <laughs> let me guess <laughs> let me tell you about Underground Gaming. Alright, so Underground Gaming has this poster, right? No, never mind, we're not getting it. All I'm saying is that Magneto would destroy Iron Man. <laughs> <laughs> Iron Man, okay, guys. Iron Man could never beat Magneto, right? Because what is what, what is, is Iron? Iron Man's suit made out of? Mm, one, two, three. Metal, yeah. <laughs> what does Magneto do? Metal bender. He's a metal bender. You know, yeah. Magneto, he would just like, okay, give me the camera. <laughs> give me the camera, dude. Okay, so Magneto, he'd go like this. He'd be like, Iron Man. Oh, dude. Okay, he's going to cut me off, dude. He's going to be like, Iron Man. And then this, this is what he does. He just goes. Then he crushes him. And just uh, the poor human soul of Tony Stark just is crushed, man. And then we have just plenty of other theories. You know, like if Iron Man took the suit off and so now he has no magnet. Then Magneto would just take his helmet off and just thrust it into Iron Man's chest. He's dead, dude. And you know what else? Furthermore. There's metal shards in Tony Stark's heart, right? That's the point of the thing. The thing? The thing. The so, <laughs> there's metal that close to his heart. I mean, Magneto would just move it. Like, just one little millimeter to say, Sup, heart. Gotcha. And Tony Stark's dead, dude. He's just a poor human. You can't deal with an X-Man. Okay? And that's all I'm saying <laughs> is that Underground Gaming has this poster up, right? That has the nerve, the audacity. To have Magneto shown fighting Iron Man. <laughs> Do you think Iron Man would even attempt that? That's like Wolverine trying to fight Iron Man. Dude knows he's getting bodied. But at least Wolverine like doesn't even mess around with it, right? Like he stays away. Like I just want to know what was going on like in that universe where like everybody's fighting like the Avengers versus X-Men and they're going at it and it's just like going on, it's like, dude. Like Iron Man's like, don't worry, guys. I got this one. <laughs> and like, no. <laughs> you think he'd be fighting Magneto? No, dude. Anyway, that was a nice comment. <laughs> Why is... I actually don't want to commentate anymore. I just want to tell more stories. <laughs> and I didn't mean to say Magneto is an X-Men, but you know what I'm saying. I'm just saying he's, like, from that stuff, dude. Okay, that's all I'm saying. He's in those books with the comic strips. Dude, I'm. it's tired, like, late time, okay? Yeah. But, uh, I mean... Magneto, though, he is pretty OP. In Marvel? And, I mean, in Iron Man, he's weak, dude. Now, who would win Iron Man versus Batman? Iron Man. Think so? Yeah. Why is that? Can't punch through a suit of armor. What's, what's Batman's main form of killing? Or, you know, apprehending. It's yeah, all, but okay, but all get hand, this. Hand so combat. Batman has the, like, the wealth, right? Yeah. And, and he just always has everything. In all the in all the stories like in all the comics like Batman always ends up with something like he's got kryptonite and stuff right yeah so he, I I propose to you that what if Batman had <laughs> Magneto okay and he, yeah, just he says, buys Magneto and he's just like yeah, he so buys he one pays Magneto he goes and he Mag says <laughs> hey dude I've got something for you he just <laughs> fight this dude and so like he just uh, <laughs> Magneto just comes out and just completely just kills Iron Man. Yeah, you go to the so Mag Batman wins. You go to the <laughs> Magneto store, pick yourself up a Magneto <laughs> from the clearance section. Tell I mean, <laughs> I don't think people understand how strong helmet theory is. Helmet theory. Helmet theory is the th the idea that in any scenario <laughs> that they don't have anything to magnetize, uh, Magneto would just take his helmet off, bless it with magnetism, and just thrust it into the poor chest, <laughs> the lungs of his opponent. <laughs> And uh, they would die. So, like, that's why, like, Xavier and all them, dude, that's why they don't even mess with Magneto. You ever wonder why Xavier just wants to play chess? <laughs> <laughs> that dude ain't gonna fight Magneto, dude. I mean, come on, man. <laughs> <laughs> you know, <I'm> just <laughs> After careful consideration of the helmet theory. Dude, trust me, man. We had a discussion the whole way back from Des Moines after, like, some tournament. What tournament? Spring Showdown, I think? And we discussed helmet theory the entire way back, and there was no like there was no counter to helmet theory. I don't know. We thought of something pretty pretty deep though. Like if it was Magneto versus Magneto, <laughs> like if he traveled through time and came back to fight himself, <laughs> because the only way to defeat helmet theory would for Magneto <laughs> to end his own life. <laughs> you know, like the ultimate counter is committing honorable magnetic Sudoku. Yeah, <laughs> I mean, 
And then, and then, well, it was actually going to be like a movie. We came up with like a script for like Magneto doing that because like Magneto's actually the hero. Like people think he's the bad guy, but he's actually the good guy. He's a troubled And the soul. way that the movie yeah. ends is that he, that's what he does. He, he realizes that he is the monster and he needs to go back in time and kill himself. Wow. But then he can't kill himself. No, never mind, dude. He can't kill himself. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> Goku versus Superman? Goku wins. Oh, Goku is weak, dude. Goku wins. Vegeta greater than Goku. I am all. Oh, man. Uh, so yeah, Smeesh is uh, getting now, tickle torqued right now. This The thing is, okay, so earlier today, Magic beat Noah with Sheik. Okay. So Magic's Sheik is pretty good against Falcon. And it's because of this matchup right here. He's played Sheik against Devin's Falcon so many times that that's basically what he was thinking when he picked this against Noah. Now, the thing is, is that obviously since this is the matchup that Magic got this idea from, Devin knows how to fight the Sheik. So um, that's why he's having a hard time with it. And honestly, I think Devin's probably going to run away with this one. Um, they, these guys have played together so much. They both know how each other plays. But... Um, I mean, Devin's playing really, really good today. Just walks up and grabs him. Yeah. I've seen uh, Smeesh today. He's been pretty pretty hit or miss, but uh, he is still... When he hits, he hits hard. When he misses, he doesn't miss so hard. But, wow, that was super fast. Yeah, this matchup, I guess on FD is not in either character's favor, right? They both have stuff on each other. Um. Yeah, and the thing is, is that this is a good stage... I mean, a lot of people think Falcon should just, you know, run wild on this stage. But the thing is, is that if Magic gets a grab and just... And Tech know, Chases. Yeah, just plays well infinity, enough, yeah. he will kill... He'll take Devin's stock with it. So, yeah. um, that that was the idea of him going here. Unfortunately, I'm not so sure um, how it's going to go. Oh, forward smash. That's probably an input error. It's supposed to be a forward tilt. Just Randy knee. Ooh, nice. Okay. Reads the spot dodge with the back The one end. thing I do... I think is hard about fighting Falcon here, even if you are Sheik, is that like, yeah, your grab game is good, but it's so hard. Oh. Wow, Devin wow, is just... Wow, he's trying to go in. Yeah, he's he's getting into his element right now. If that would have hit, I would have giffy catted it and thrown it, on a, thrown it on Reddit. But like, fighting Falcon can be very difficult here because of the way that like, once he gets started and gets you in the air, you have you no are, platforms you're at to. his mercy. Yeah. yeah, I mean, it's it's really hard to just keep up with him and you have to play extremely fast. Um, and so, like, if you mess up one fast fall and you're out there floating a little bit, you're going to, you know, get beat up. Yeah. Oh. Okay, knees. Yeah, Miss Pace is in the knees. So, loser of this gets fifth place. Winner moves on to uh, fight for fourth. Yeah, and I do believe that fourth place is getting, or fifth place, sorry, is getting forty dollars each. A piece, nice. Wow, that's actually pretty good. And then um, fourth place, I'm not so sure. It's probably closer to, you know, good eighty. Yeah. Just can't get down here. Just gonna eat up air after up air. It was better the first time, guess. They're talking about. Helmet Theory and Magneto just being yeah. god, but yeah, that train's left the station. This that, that story was so. Let me tell you, dude. I'm, story I'm was bringing so the train back. This story <laughs> was so good that Noah threw up in my car. What? He seriously did. We were in the back seat. What? He was eating a cinnamon toast crunch, crunch shake from Zombie Burger. That's disgusting. And me and Cam are sitting there. Cam's in the front seat. I'm driving, and I'm telling this story. And all of a sudden, you just hear, <laughs> and you're just like, Jesus. And you're just like, what the. We were like, dude, are you okay? And he's just laughing, dude. And we're like, what? Like, and we look back, it was the and he just theory. had cinnamon toast crunch shake all over his stomach. Oh and I was, and then it was like in the, on the floor. And then he, we had like, okay, so pardon the smash. We had this guy's t-shirt right here. I had a bunch of these. I had an extra one in my car. And we had to use that shirt to clean up the vomit from Noah. And then... We left it in Des Moines in a parking lot of a like Bank of oh the West. Oh my God! And dude, I know Dark Rain found it. And that's how he was tracing us. <laughs> and then he was like, "Oh and my God, I really need to Falcon punch this gas station." Yeah. To leave behind my trail that I was ever here. Exactly. And we've come full circle. Have you heard the story before? I mean, that's exactly what happened. 